Hi there, welcome to Max Modded Skyrim. <laughs> She's like, it's this way, dum dum. <laughs> there we go. Oh god, where are these fuckers? Is that my Dramora or a real one? Kingdom come. Emphasis on come. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> that was asinine. Yeah, so it's getting stuck behind this door. In fact, that's even more asinine. Uh, am I just going in circles? Uh, yeah, it definitely feels like it. Yeah, because I went that way, and then this was the door that I didn't go through, and I went left, so what the F? I know, I know. If it was easy to find a way out, everybody would do it. Love backtrack, oh, Jesus. Why? We are we're going in arsenine circles. There's the Jesus picture. Jesus. There's the Jesus picture. It can't be way down here, can it? Did I miss something? This is where I came at. Dumb. Wake up! Daydreaming about me. It must be in this room, right? Am I missing something obvious in here? How can I possibly be lost? This castle isn't that big. Ah! Okay. Yeah, I could be 
and then just lean down because you know uh -huh. that I can't hit anything below my waist. That's when I'm going for a crotch shot. So in my defense, <laughs> my stupid iPhone. Well, you still can. <laughs> Good enough. My stupid iPhone <laughs> alt tabbed me out into somewhere else, and my recording software turned off. And obviously, I can't deal with those kind of shenanigans and my ineptitude at the same time. barely fight Trollox when I don't have any problems. <laughs> like a boy, especially when there's five of them. Give me a break. Yeah, Avenue, you have Careful. the right idea. You wouldn't like to hurt my face. Okay. Good. Okay. <laughs> so I don't feel I would have died there in the real world. fire pit of death. Of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? Yeah? Alright. Yep. Okay. You'll be lucky if you didn't break anything more than your scalp. You look capable, but you don't do Broke so well falling. Neck. Give me your water flask, Garwen. I need to wash this. Oh. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up, you dumb dumb. Hold still. Don't be offended. She always expects everybody to do what she tells them. That makes her so time, different from exactly every other human says. being on the planet. Most people. Not Mother, of course. Sure. No one gives orders to Mother. I am Elaine, and this is my brother, Garwen. Hey, baby. Our mother is Morgays, by the grace of the light, Queen of Andor, Defender of the Realm, High Seat of the House Trakan. Uh, okay. Uh, none of that is true. Without even telling us your name. <laughs> well, you know our names. Courtesy would suggest you give us yours. I'm Dova, a Dova Queen. Thank you. Now, we should get you out of here quickly. Mother would not approve of a stranger in the palace. Yeah. Follow me. Sounds like I didn't actually accomplish anything, though. I was about to say, if it throws me into first person again, like this mod has a tendency to do, I was going to be annoyed. Stand away from her, Lady Elaine. You too, Lord Garwin. This woman is my guest and here under my protection. You may withdraw, Talonvor. I regret that will not be possible, my lady. As my lady knows, the Queen has given orders regarding anyone on palace grounds without Her Majesty's permission. Word has been sent to Her Majesty of this intruder. You will conduct all three of us to my mother, or else conduct all three of us yeah, to a cell. going to cop a squad here while you guys figure this out. Together. Or will you give orders for hands to be laid upon my person? Ooh. Like the Queen the commands me to bring the intruder to her immediately. It is also the Queen's command that my Lady Elaine and Lord Gawain attend her. 
If my lady pleases. I thought you were gonna wash the blood off Remember of me, yourself. lady. Speak up clearly when you're spoken to and keep silent otherwise. Don't tell me what to do. And follow my lead. <laughs> All will be well. Look, they've already helped themselves to the living room. That's hilarious. What's in here? Can I take this shit? It looks like I can. Huh, do they have any shit worth stealing in here? What is that, a radish? Mother, I'm I taking that. You have been exploring the I'm taking that. Daughter, I have thought better of you. They aren't even going to wait for me, are they? What books do they have? Alright. But at the same time, to be counterweight for her against disaster. Perhaps this if your is training room. is intensified, you will find less time for letting your sister lead you into trouble. Yeah. I will ask the Captain General to see that you do not lack for things to do on the journey to the White Tower. As you command, Mother. Mother, I do mean to he obey you. He sounded pretty truly, snarky when he said that. You do. For a submissive yes. man. You do try to be a dutiful daughter. But you constantly test how far you can zoom in. Well, how come I can't zoom in or out? That spirit will stand you in good stead Fuck. when you ascend to the throne. <laughs> but you are not queen yet, child. Now, there is the problem of this woman, and how and why she came here. The Dark One I come anywhere I want. The shadow lies across the pattern, and the future is balanced on the point of a pin. In two days, the daughter heir yeah, will be taken north to the White Tower for her training. And at just this juncture, someone appears in the palace grounds. Mother, I beg you not to harm her. Let's take a look at she her. She would have left immediately had I not stopped her. She wanted to go. It was I who made her I like stay. Your 80s haircut. I cannot believe she is a dark friend. When I took the throne, I swore to uphold justice for the high and the low. And I will uphold it, even if I am the last in Andor to remember justice. Do you mean harm to the throne of Andor? Or to my daughter? Or my son? I'm gonna break your son's heart. I will give you justice then. I will uphold the laws I have made. I give you your freedom, but I suggest you take a care where you trespass in the future. That's not really my If you are found on the palace grounds again, it will not go so easily with you. Mm. Elida. Don't threaten please, me. Please, send our guest on her way. Yep. If I had told Mother I think you're good looking, she certainly would have had you locked in a cell. Well, yeah. Fare you well. I mean, <laughs> you're not blind. Ah. Okay, that was abrupt. <laughs> huh, and there you go. That's the end in the that quest weird all right and on that rather anticlimactic note i know that's why you're sad <laughs> see you next time bye bye